All right, we are ready for day 14 of Force Fetch with 11 month old Liesl. Um, I've already placed dummies down our driveway so we can start with a, a ladder drill that's essentially blind. I mean, she's going to see the dummies as she gets out and starts working away from me. So we'll do that and then we'll move directly into a blind retreat from there. So pay attention as I'm sending her that I'm making sure she's lined up, that she's focused with each send. I'm going to be ready with the halt whistle to stop her if she starts going awry on either side. Uh, on deliveries at this point, she should be sitting without being told to sit, but I can't help but give some hand signals. I'll try to wean her off of that a little bit and uh, we'll go from there. But we've got dummies going out to about 65 meters at this point. So let's go ahead and get started. Lisa, yep. When they do drop, always back up a few steps, make them come further, so that's kind of the correction for making a mistake. Good. Drop. I think that's the first drop she's had in several days. So, again, I'm kind of glad she did it. I'd rather she do it now than later on. Sit. trouble getting them focused just take one more step with them to get them in the right direction so Lisa yep sit Good dog. So nice. Oh, very nice. Good. Drop. Thank you. Good girl. It's nice to see her going out at that distance. So now we can start sending her another direction. So now let's move over. I've previously planted the squirrel dummy out in the grass, so this is going to be a true blind where she's not going to see it until she's right on top of it. Lisa, here. Go. All right, so remember where you put it so you can give them a good line. And it is good to hesitate a little as you line them up so that they can pick out a tree, a building, something in the distance that helps them with the mark and stay on line. This will come in really handy later at the water. And again, she's looking slightly to the right, so I'm going to take a step to get her lined up where I want her. Here. Sit. So important to start them off on a good line. a good dog. You don't like stickers, huh? Good. Good girl. Good job. Drop. Good job. Good. All right, that blind was probably only about 20 meters away. Liesl, sit. 
So I know it wasn't the most difficult, but if you recall our video from two days ago, we were really struggling to get her to go out 20 meters. So it's amazing, again, just what it does to let him sleep on it. We did a few review drills in the house yesterday, and then just coming back to today, we started with the ladder drill to get her thinking that she had to move out straight. So it was no big deal when I sent her in the grass with no real mowed line or straight line that she was able to take that. It's really good. So next, we're gonna move back into that baseball diamond drill. But because she was struggling so much with back, I decided that rather than adding, you know, the first and third base, that we will just do the back retrieve and get her comfortable with just turning around and going behind her for a back. And then once she's doing that, we'll add the other two bases so that we can do, you know, over, back, and over directional signals. So let's get reset up here. Lisa, Lisa, come behind her so that it's a little easier for her to connect the dots what the back signal means. Stay. This is making it so much easier. I'm also giving her a lot of space. I don't think I'm going to have to give her a lot of physical touch here. Lisa, ready? Why we always have a whistle when training outdoors. Something that they've always been good at, like Liesl's never really tried to not return something to me. Drop. But it was good to be able to call her there quickly. Stay. Ready? Back. Good. She's grasping this much better. Good job! Good. Alright, I'm going to send her a little bit further now that she's getting it. So these are essentially marked retrieves. But we're building up her confidence in what the hand signal means, which is the most important thing. Ready? Ah! Wait. Love seeing the excitement. Lisa. backs in a row, so now we'll add the other two dummies in. Stay. Stay. I'm still putting her favorite dummy behind her to still help her try to succeed. All right, this is going to be the toughest because she's wanna, going to want to go backwards, but I'm not going to let her. I'm going to make her go over first. Ready? Lethal. Back. Good. Good girl. Good job. Drop. Good. Ready? Set. I have my whistle ready. Make sure you get their attention before you send them. I usually just say ready. I'll take a shuffle step to get their attention via sound if necessary. Lisa, ready? Fetch. Yes, very good. Here, turn this way though. Good. 
Good job. Drop. Very nice. All right. Try the back. Ready? Yep. confusion there, but we were able to work it out. Just keep a positive attitude. Take steps towards the dummy. Keep pointing. Help them figure it out. Good. Now we'll do an easy one. Ready? See? Look up. Back. Yes! Good girl! Good. Good job. tail just fell off. This dummy's been in use for many years. Good. Drop. It's really important to read your dog there. She wasn't 100% sure what to do, but she wasn't misbehaving either. So that's why I didn't really punish her, correct her. I just gave her another moment to figure it out. Ready? Set. Back. Good. Just taking that one extra stutter step and continuing to keep your arm out will really help. And of course, once you get to test day and they're across the water, drop. It's gonna be hard for them to see you, so it's important for you to keep those big exaggerated motions. All right, I'm gonna keep this dummy now so it doesn't serve as distraction. Ready, Lee? Anywhere. to end on something that's not a total success, drop. So I'm gonna have her retrieve just this one dummy again. We're gonna go back to the back drill we started with, okay? some hesitation there so let's do it one more time see if we can get something cleaner drop good job all right come here Heel. keep working on that a little bit in the house this evening um, just because she's doing really well but I just want her to feel more confident more assured in herself to go get it ah sit Liesl okay. all right I think that's a good place to stop the video for now I'm gonna go grab uh, game. I think the next step for Liesl, she's doing so well on all these retrieves, is that it's time to introduce her to some real game. 
So in this case, it's gonna be half thawed squirrel. So let me go ahead and reset. We'll start the video here again in just a second. 